Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Since we have entered the new year, it's time for celebration and I've decided to prepare a cake. And this time it's going to be a cake without eggs. All my life I have prepared cakes with eggs and uh, I, I was quite skeptical to take up the challenge to prepare a cake without eggs. I have watched a couple of videos, I have seen how people prepare eggless cakes but to be able to actually get into the whole ingredients in the process of an eggless cake preparation was kind of like a very shaky idea for me but uh, somehow I decided to take up the challenge so if you want to join me in the challenge of preparing an eggless cake keep watching For this eggless cake preparation, we are going to set aside the wet ingredients and the dry ingredients. First up, we are going to prepare the wet ingredients. We are now going to commence with brown sugar to which we are going to add a cup or 100 grams of yogurt. We are going to whisk the ingredients together until they are well combined and the brown sugar is all dissolved. Next step here is to add vanilla essence and I have got butter vanilla here and this smells like toffee. So you can add vanilla essence if you don't have this particular ingredient in your pantry. As I'm whisking the butter vanilla in my wet ingredients, it is releasing that toffee like aroma in my kitchen. To this, we are going to add 6 tablespoons of cooking oil. Now that my wet ingredients are well combined, we are going to shift to my dry ingredients. For the dry ingredients, we are going to start off first with all-purpose flour or baking flour. We are going to take 12 tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Side note here, we are going to sieve all my dry ingredients so that we can avoid the clumps or the air bubbles that happen during the process of folding the flour in the wet ingredients. To this we add 6 tablespoons of cocoa powder.
two baking elements here are a teaspoon of baking powder and two teaspoons of baking soda. I'm going to mix all the dry ingredients until they are well combined and it is ready to be folded in the wet ingredients. At regular intervals here we are going to add 2-3 to three tablespoons of the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients and we are going to fold. We'll keep folding and we'll keep adding the dry ingredients. We are going to follow the 8 shape pattern to fold the ingredients. Bear in mind we do not press and thoroughly mix, mix the ingredients like you're with whisking your eggs. You don't do that. You just follow the pattern of the 8 shape so that is how you fold the wet into the dry ingredients The cake batter is ready and I have prepared three aluminium tins. Unfortunately we are not going to use all three, we are just going to stick to two because the batter is not of a huge quantity. We are going to bake each tin for 160 degrees celsius for 15 minutes. The whole eggless cake baking was a success and now I'm going to shift it to a plate and refrigerate it. For frosting or icing of the cake I'm going to use a dairy free whipped cream. So the one I'm using is by the brand Tropolite. Again in my whipping cream I have added butter vanilla essence and I'll keep whisking until it's air light and fluffy with stiff peaks. I'm going to separate this whipping cream in two portions one of which will be chocolate and the other one will be of orange compound chocolate. I'm going to use the double boiler method to melt each of these chocolates.
Finally, it's time to add the frosting or the icing to the cakes prepared earlier which are refrigerated and I am going to just take dollops of the whipping cream and spread it as simple as that. I'm not going to use any fancy method of icing. I have used the orange colored frosting only for the internal area of my cake and for the outer portion I will be using the chocolate one. If you like this eggless cake bake challenge hit the like button and if you want to join the family or you want to join me to eat the cake subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell and if you have any complicated recipes like these comment in the section below and I'll be posting videos whenever I'm free so that's all for today bye